Well, uh, plants are advancing their time in which they flower in response to climate change. At least in the Northern Hemisphere, uh, in temperate regions, we have known this for quite a few decades, but we are still needing uh, to understand how this is happening in areas where biodiversity is larger, when uh, higher, uh, such as the Mediterranean. And it seems that in the Mediterranean, plants are also advancing. So they are flowering earlier and earlier each year in response to the higher temperature. Plants mainly read uh, three climatic factors for flowering, which are the length of the days, the temperature, and the precipitations. And the length of the day is not changing with climate change. What is changing the most is temperature. So as temperature rises more and more each year, plants advance their flowering because they are able to accumulate degrees of temperature earlier in the year. Yeah, well, nearly all of the results surprised us. Uh, it was very surprising to find that the, the amount of days that plants are flowering earlier since the 80s is so, so high. They are flowering, uh, nearly 90% of the species are flowering a mean value of 19 days in 35 years, which means uh, a whole day each two years. That is very surprising because it's very fast compared to other areas of the world. And it also surprised us to check that uh, the differences between species were explained by functional traits that was known from previous works, but the traits that are behind the change, uh, the difference in change in the Mediterranean uh, were very particular. And reproductive traits such as the investment in flowers were very important to explain differences. And also when in the year the different species flower because winter flowering species are advancing very much faster than summer flowering species.